One more. Um, I want to, I'm curious, every step of the way throughout this trial, Judge Mershon has been, I would personally say, aggressive towards Donald Trump, not mm -hmm. friendly to the defense. And then now all of a sudden he's going to sentence, he's going to delay sentencing. I mean, from the outside, I'm looking at this going, what's the motivation? Clearly, every time Donald Trump's been indicted or they've gone after him, his poll numbers and fundraising have gone up. And Mershon has seemed very political. Was this a political calculation by Mershon? I mean, it seems to me that he's in a pickle. Right? Judge Mershon's in a pickle. What do I do? I sentence someone who's running, running right now, the forerunner. He will probably be elected president. I sentence him before he gets elected. When the Supreme Court came down with a case that pretty much invalidates the entire state court case, right. all of the evidence, how do you do that? So, of course, there's going to be an appeal. The Supreme Court already said the evidence you used in this case, Prosecutor Alvin Bragg, cannot be used against a former president. Because of presidential immunity. Exactly. Yeah. So what we're looking at then is a situation where Judge Mershon's probably saying, well, if I sentence him, that's not going to work. And if I wait, at least we'll see what's going to happen. Right. And, you know, he'll probably and anyone who read the Supreme Court decision should just reverse yeah it's a bad it's a bad legal decision which which will probably be one on appeal at some level sure. I also think that Mershon's a political character and he and, and at some point you have to look at the political calculation as well I think he mm -hmm. did yeah um, and go wow this will help Donald Trump if I sentence him well, probably if... we'll never know at this point